Welcome back y'all, it's your boy Slave for Red, and I want to give you all a huge thank you for coming out and checking out today's video. What we're doing is we're going to some highly sought after e-liquid. Huge thank you to everybody at Shopee and B for sending this out, and not only that, a big shout out to Batman for actually putting out this line. What we're touching on today is Sabores de Encanto. This is an e-liquid line, it does have that of like a Puerto Rican theme to it. Batman wanted to put out some flavors that actually are tied to his heritage. So me being Hispanic and wanting to try these as well, I wanted to see if they actually tied in to some of the things I know. Some of these are a little bit different. There are stuff that I'm actually not used to as far as the Mexican heritage myself that I have, but I'm gonna try to do my best and let you know what I'm experiencing on these e-liquids. So again, this is the Sabores de Encanto pretty much means flavors that I love or flavors of love. That is what Sabores de Encanto actually means when I read it. Here on the front, it actually states exclusive dessert flavors from the islands of Puerto Rico. So I'm stoked to give you guys my opinion, what I think, what I'm experiencing throughout the vape, and we're gonna get started on this one. What we're gonna do is we're gonna be dividing it up. So there's gonna be a different e-liquid in each video, and we are starting on Canita de Queso. This is cream cheese flake pastry. I love a lot of those little flaky pastries that I get at like the corner store. I've gone over some e-liquids like this, so I'm stoked to actually see what this actually has to offer. And normally the cream cheese flaky pastry is the one I actually go to. So I wanted to start this off selfishly and go to an e-liquid that I pretty much would go to as a dessert. So without further ado, we are going over this first e-liquid. So that's what the bottle actually looks like. What we're going to do is we're going to do a smell test. Getting remnants of like a cream cheese, most definitely. What it does make me think of, it almost makes me think of like a custard. When you smell a custard e-liquid off the bottle, that's exactly the remnants of what I'm getting off of the smell. <sighs> I'm excited for this one. I'm truly a custard kind of fan, so that cream cheese kind of notes, I am stoked for off of this e-liquid. So we have an RDA here, all waked up and ready to go. On the Ocula RDA, sitting on top of the rudder. We have Canita de Queso off the Sabores de Encanto line from Extract and Brew and Fogging Out with the Batman going in. We most definitely started this line off right, and if all of them are spot on like this one, I'm stoked to see what each one has to offer. Like I stated off the bottle, I'm getting that nice creamy rich notes. I almost thought that of a custard. When I vape this, I was most definitely corrected. This is a spot on sweet cream cheese. You're getting a nice glaze to it overall. That actually does transition to the XL as well where you get that slight, not too overpowering kind of flaky crust at the end. You're getting a lot more of that creamy sweet cream cheese itself on the beginning and throughout the vape experience. I already can tell you right off the bat, fogging out with the Batman, what was the right company to create this even first e-liquid? I will touch on each one as we go, of course, but getting this spot on, Extract and Brew, fogging out with the Batman, took their time with this and nailed it. This is amazing. Again, I cannot emphasize enough how the sweetness and almost like a glaze kind of ties in with that cream cheese and just makes it overall satisfying. Me that loves a lot of custards and desserts, this is a sure winner. This is really good. Now, as we all know, this has been hyped up for a long time and with this first e-liquid, I can see why. 
we have a few others that we're going to go over there's actually i believe seven out of the whole line so these are going to be broken up into different videos but i really feel that we started this line off right with a really good e-liquid and i'm stoked to see what the rest have to offer again fogging out with the batman extract and brew if you're new to extract and brew head on over to their website you do sign up for their newsletter and if it's your first time ordering you get 25 percent off and the cool thing is when you sign up for their newsletter you're also put into monthly drawings and whatnot they actually hold that on their instagram just go hit them up they have all these flavors and other flavors that you actually are looking for whether you're looking for a drink a candy a fruit they have it all as an e-liquid itself up on their website and their inventory is just growing and growing huge shout out to both extract and brew and fogging out with the batman for letting me review try and just give you guys my opinion this is an exciting line that I have the honor of being able to let you guys know. So huge thank you to all of them over there at Extract and Brew. You already know, I love doing these videos for you all. We'll be seeing each other soon. And as always, keep on vaping.